and welcome to Casita Los Sueños and uh, this is a reformed rental property that uh, we've recently just completed and it's just about to uh, hit the market uh, for short-term rentals and um, what we've got here is a kind of pretty private terrace to be honest um, there is a uh, footpath that leads down to the town hall to the old part of the town just down the side here but it's lower down we've got this little wall here small garden with uh, rock wall but yeah basically you've got a three-story building very very quirky very very rustic lots of little features um, so yeah we've got uh, nice stone furniture out here with the umbrella and then uh, we've got yeah basically lots and lots of character inside okay so um, this was all newly uh, terraced uh, it's not actually belonged to the deeds but it's it's certainly uh, almost like part of the property really and uh, the town hall allowed us to uh, to improve it essentially okay so uh, literally you are walking distance to all amenities of Vimuela village from here You've got outdoor lighting as well and also we've put in fiber internet connection okay so into the main lounge area okay so again lots of recesses built-in shelves uh, lovely stove that's going to be painted just now but uh, yeah lots of wood everywhere you've got wooden beams again you've got the wooden lintels with the authentic uh, spanish wooden uh, windows and shutters stone exposed uh, throughout and yeah that obviously opens up as well on the side there so you can get a really nice breeze coming through the house very thick walls very solid just a lovely cozy uh, little lounge obviously going out into that terrace okay so this is a brand new kitchen okay and uh yeah you've got solid wooden uh, units with the kind of under just that's the the handle there so you've got um gas stove and oven okay there's a kind of a storage cupboard in there for food stuffs and what have you but yeah extractors in and new sink and then you've got storage also underneath the stairs there okay so we've converted this what was like a utility room into kind of a internal dining dining room uh, again you've got this really nice light feature that's from you see the top terrace there really nice quite quirky again and then also there is a separate kind of utility with washing machine and the hot water boiler in there okay so again really nice uh, you've got things like stable doors in as well that can open up uh, halfway as the same as upstairs and then we've got fridge freezer in with microwave okay so yeah just bags of uh, character features interesting quirky little bits we're just going to be kind of finishing it off and dressing it up over the next week um, so let's take a look upstairs so we've got basically two bedrooms two bathrooms um, this is the general bathroom, okay, whereby we've got storage there, okay, little window with a wooden lintel, toilet, bidet, nice rustic sink with the granite surround, nice uh, mirror and the lights and then a brand new glass screen with a full size bath and then overhead shower, okay, so again, this is a nice size and uh, it's all in really good nick. So this would be probably, you know, the, the second bedroom I'd say, although it's very big, okay. Um, you've got, again, the wooden beams, beautiful features. There's a, a curtain that would be able to uh, close off that entrance there. Built in, again, shelves and little cubby holes with the stone features again. I mean, yeah, it's, it's just full of really nice, a Spanish feel I would say uh, there's all storage behind those curtains there okay and then also here we put a brand new uh, railing in and this overlooks the terrace okay it's looking south overlooking the, uh, the tile tops of the village really nice okay so this is bedroom number one So we kind of keep, kept the uh, rustic furniture, rustic theme throughout. And then upstairs, go to the master bedroom. So what we've done here, again, because of the size of the, the room really, 
we put in like a workspace. Okay, again, this is gonna be finished off, but uh, that is, you know, solid wood kind of uh, laptop workspace. You got nice bedroom, beautiful kind of uh, detail in the in the roof here. Big wooden beams. Again, that's overlooking the back of the property where you got the car parking, storage, and another terrace. And here, this one has its own private balcony and also a private wet room as well with, uh, again, toilet, brand new shower, wet room and sink with the rustic brickwork and sink there, all built in. Okay, so uh, I think this is uh, going to be very popular. It's quite uh, unique, certainly in the way it's finished and the way it's furnished. Okay, so this is the private balcony at the top. Again, you can look over the uh, lower terrace there. And again, you get the sun. And it's big enough to put sun lounges on. Obviously, we've got a couple of chairs up here. But you're overlooking the entire village. Okay. So, let's just... We're not finished yet. We will uh, take a look at the back terrace. So, just bear with me. Okay, so this is more than likely probably the way you're going to come in. So again, you've got a stable door here, um, getting nicely, nicely finished. Got a nice little porch on here as well, which we've tiled. Okay, so that's where we were upstairs. That is the window downstairs into the dining room. Okay, and then we've got stairs leading up to a, another terrace. Okay, you could put barbecue in here. We got another storeroom, okay, which uh, we will do something with eventually, but uh, again, plenty of uh, potential there. So yeah, we put cushions on here, sun lounges, it's private, it's quiet. And again, you've got another kind of different look at the house from the, the back essentially. Okay, and then just to finish off, we go up the stairway here and we've got our own private off-road parking. So there we are, that's uh, Los Sueños, Casita Los Sueños. And here we have the carport. Okay, so it's got parking for one vehicle. Again, that's all private. And uh, obviously we can, uh, you know, secure any clients that they're gonna have a, a parking space. Okay guys, so if you are interested, obviously contact us directly on uh, 0034 or indeed view our website villasolutions.net. Thank you.